Okay, so I just came downstairs and my grandma and grandpa were like, oh my god, good morning. And my grandpa was like, oh my god, you were sleeping for so long I saw you were dead. Yeah. So, house tour. So, this is the entrance of my house. Not my house, my grandma's house. <laughs> and then we go in. <laughs> Oh, and tip, like when you go into a Japanese home, you have to say ojamashimasu, which is, which for real, just like means I will be a burden or something like that. It's just like to show respect and um, yeah, that's umbrellas. We love umbrellas. This is like the take off your shoes place. So take off your shoes here. And then we have a little thing, um, fireworks picture we love because this place is really famous for fireworks little winter plants we love she's got plants always and a little map and then we have like a few doors sliding door things she's, these are the two paintings my grandma bought from her friend because she couldn't say no but was like oh it, it's not too bad but it's too big because my grandma is a minimalist and she doesn't like having a lot of stuff that's some storage space that's just like that and then the bathroom is that's just you know your average bathroom i guess and then if we go in here we have the living room well like the dining slash kitchen area kitchen looks like that very nice um it's like that we've got a few plants in here during winter because it's too cold out because it snows and stuff so they're they're being saved um Average dining table, TV, uh, stuff, um, cups, yeah. This is your bathroom, shower. Ah! So, we've got a bin here. We love bins. Oops. Um, yeah, sink, washing machine, um, shower. Yeah, so you open that and that's the bathtub and then, yeah everything's quite normal for me and then if we walk in here we've got the living room and so this is what we use during winter and we turn that on and then like they have a heating thing um underneath and it lights up and it becomes super warm and this is like basically a big huge blanket so we all just like put sit here together all cozied up and warm and it's really nice i love it there um um yeah kimono person that's gonna haunt me isn't it yeah um a vase thing and like after or like the day before the new year's she'll like put a huge like painting thing um here i think you can kind of see like the the remains of it yeah and then we've got a little section here again. Very nice, very nice. And like all these like top things are all calculated, which is like really cool, I think. Yeah, and we've got a little, forgot about that. I don't even know if we can film that. I guess you can. Um, it's like a little Shinto um, god house. Yeah, the god lives there. And we clean it out every um, New Year's like before new year's, new year's and there's like rules about like all everything that's there basically there's some offerings there i'm not entirely sure how that works but um yeah it's it's sacred and a lot of old houses have that um we've got a little spot nice and then some houses hello and then we've got another kimono person i think I'm not sure it's gonna haunt me too sorry that's not very nice to say and then we've got some expensive um things yes antique things i'm not gonna open those because i don't want to find anything i don't want to find and so like a lot of rooms are just like divided by these sliding doors and we don't have like proper open closed doors and a lot of them's just this and i think it's quite pretty because look at how sophisticated that is, you know? And also look at, like, the details of that. Are you serious? It is so pretty. Yeah. 
And so if we open this, we get one big living room. And if we close it, we get two small living rooms, which is quite nice. Um, Second-ish living room, we've got two <coughs> windows-ish doors things. Oh, these, this is really cool too. So you can just like go like that and pull it down. These are... These are basically windows, and they're um, made out of really, really thin paper. And it's really nice, because, like, it gets a nice um, amount of light in, I reckon. And, yeah, that's TV, my grandpa's chill spot. He loves books. He reads so much. I'm not even kidding. That's my grandpa's other setting, set, setting spot. Um, some drawers. Um... Yeah, so that's how it works. And then we have a little telephone corner where they pick up calls. They have another telephone in the living room. So, yeah, some more drawers of things. And then we can go upstairs. And this is one of the, the steepest stairs I've seen. But honestly, my other grandma's house has steeper stairs. So a lot of old houses have really steep stairs, I reckon. And then the second floor is like that. I've got a bunch of my stuff scattered there. So, sorry. And um, we don't have bed beds. We sleep on the floor. And we've got, like, we've got a thick blanket right now because it's winter. And then we have, like, this mattress thing. And this whole situation is called a futon, if you didn't know. Um, yeah, so that's how it works can see some mountains there very nice um some drawers it's really bright this um second floor yeah that's my grandma that's my grandma and grandpa on christmas very cute and then the other half of the second floor is this place also you like use the sliding doors and it's very nice look at that wowzers <sighs> yeah, and you've got a few things, um, some clothing here, and yeah, some other futons because my dad and cousin is going to come sleep over. Yeah, so that's about it. <laughs>